Rob, before we get into Richmond, let's talk about the game against Hartby. What was it that pleased you most about that victory? Um, well, apart from getting five points, which is what we wanted, um, I think probably the most pleasing thing was our reaction at half-time. We, we showed up our defence and, and to nil them in the second half and pull away was, was really pleasing. Any lessons from Saturday that you're taking into the Richmond game this weekend? Uh, yeah, lots. Look, I think our, they breached us in our defence first half. I don't think our tackling was up to up to the standard we want. We bounced off a few hits. It wasn't through lack of effort and boys trying to make their tackles with just a bit of technique. So um, we've done a bit of work on that and, and just trying to plug those holes, really, yeah. Let's talk about Richmond. What is it that you see in their game this season? Yeah, tough team. Uh, big forward pack, very big forward pack. Um, with some gnarly characters in it. So we've got a job to do up front. I think first and foremost, away from home, that's where it's gonna, gonna start. We have a plan and we, we, we challenge ourselves to stick to that plan as much as we can. Obviously injury comes in and form like you say, but then you've got to give other people a chance to play as well to show their form. And sometimes lads benefit from that and other times, you know, they probably feel they shouldn't, they get, should have a bit more. And it's, it's tough to manage. And what we've got to do is we've got a unique environment here where you know, we're all here on this island and the lads are rugby players, not rugby trainers. It's important that they all get a chance to go and they all come on this journey and, and train every day and that's part of why we've got such a tight squad, is that they all muck in for each other and then we've got to reward that and trust in the squad. Um, there'll be no point us signing a guy here and then not playing him, so that's what that's the challenge for us. Um, as much as we can, we try and stick to that plan, yeah. yeah. Where we are at now is that, for example, after the Heartbreak game, where we've got five points at home, is we, we're trying to figure out how we get better from that performance. And there was lots of it, lots in it that probably wasn't where we want it to be. And, and the guys come in on a Monday and they're the first ones to say, actually, that wasn't great or this wasn't great or we can fix that up. And we've got to stay ahead of those things so that we don't come unstuck and we don't slip up. And that, that's the constant challenge is to, is to stay on that and, and keep grinding away. And the challenge that we've got now is we've got to do it for nine, nine games in a row after the rearranged fixture. So we've got to keep things fresh and keep things fun and, and also but then stay battle-hardened. So, yeah, all, put that all into a mix and you come out with some, with some tough training weeks. But boys are responding really well.